Hi everyone, it's me, Lena the Plug. Welcome back to my channel where I do something random every time. Today I'm baking mini cheesecakes with Miss Lana Rhodes. You know her and her whole body, every <laughs> little part of it. <laughs> it's me, your favorite stepsister, Lana. Oh my god. I have not seen that scene, but I keep seeing you referenced as the favorite stepsister, so I'm gonna probably go do some research. They're talking about the one whenever I sit on my stepbrother's pee that's on this toilet seat, and then he wipes it off, and then somehow he ends up inside of me. <laughs> oh, very interesting plot. Very, very creative. It's, it's funny how porn works, huh? Anyways, today we're making cheesecake, because I was hanging out with Lana like a month ago. She's like, I'm really good at baking. So I really want to test her skills and see, you know, she's good at being a stepsister. Wait, but wait, now she's also good at cheesecake. Wait, this is no bake though, right? No, this is bake. Oh wait, what? I thought this was no baking. <laughs> she you just put it in the fridge. Yeah, I mean, it's it's it says it only takes 20 minutes to prep and 25 minutes to cook. I think between two of us with our IQs, we could probably handle that. We're gonna be eating in no time. Yeah, also my sister like prepped everything for us, so I think we should, if we cannot succeed at this right now, I don't think we could do anything in life. I think we should just stop right now. I'm excited for the final product. I haven't had these in like, since I was a little kid, me and my cousins used to make these little no baking cheese. Maybe you've never had them since these are actually gonna get baked. baked <laughs> so maybe, we'll see which ones are better. First step, Preheat oven to 350 degrees. Is it done? Did you do that? It is preheated. Preheated. So preheat, check. Check, check. Check, check. Okay. <laughs> Line a 12 count muffin pan with nine to 10 liners, which is really weird. Did it done so? It's not gonna even make the whole pan. It's so easy to bake when someone else does everything for you. I'm just gonna go ahead like and smash this like this. What do you think? I washed my hands. Yeah, yeah, we already washed our hands. Wait, you have finger tattoos? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now you have to tell us what's on your fingers. This one says you are no one. This one says you are number one. Wait, that, you are that? no one. You are number one. Is yeah. it like to help you like remain like in perspective, balanced? like balanced, yeah. like not too big of an ego, but not. Too. It's also that it looks almost exactly the same, but they mean like very different things. Yeah, yeah, so no, that's it's true. Glass half full or glass that's half empty. Actually, what are you gonna choose to look at, Lana? I actually really like that tattoo. Like I've been struggling a lot with like that. Oh, oh my bitch. gosh. You're such a bad baker. <laughs> she punched it. I'm a boxer. She's like, I'm gonna lose all the ingredients. <laughs> my sister is like a backseat baker right now. She's like, these Instagram models don't know what they're doing. You got it. Wait, is this one for the family channel or for the regular channel? This is for the regular channel. Okay, I'm like grabbing your hand. I don't think we can talk about it and also put it on my family oh. channel. <laughs> When's the last time you got a facial? Oh my God. My skin's literally breaking out right now because someone told me, try a Hydra facial, try a Hydra facial. I just I got one. Did it make you break out? Has this been all over my face? Like, You look totally fine, but. I mean, it's all over. But I got also, like one zit after mine, like a big one, but it was yeah, just one. It was actually right where this one is. It's because all the chemicals that they're like, it's um because the hydrofacial is just a bunch of like lactic acids and like acids and stuff. It so it freaking can bring hurt. a lot of stuff up. Um, and I'm like really struggling with my skin right now. Everyone at home will let you know in the comments that you look beautiful right now, Lana. Oh. Have you guys ever done anything sexually off camera? What? No. <laughs> oh, us, like, oh, us together? Have we ever hooked up when the cameras are off? No. No, I'm pretty a prude in real life. Um, she really is. Do you want to tell them? <laughs> um, I mean, do you want me to tell them? I don't like saliva. I don't like I don't like any type of body fluids getting on me unless I'm like madly in love with you. Like at first, like I wouldn't even kiss Mike until like I really liked him. Like now I'm so like, funny. he still can't like get his on me. Like it's grossing me out. <laughs> Honestly, I feel you like I don't know one time Adam like on someone else and I was supposed to slurp it up and I was trying not to gash <laughs> Oh my god, I was like, please dear god let the camera not show how much I hate this on my face For some reason it was so gross to me because you could see all the like texture in it. I'm sorry you're like, oh. <laughs> oh my god, this video is not gonna make it on YouTube But have I told you this before my favorite Finishing thing is a cream pie so that I don't, don't have, have to, to touch look it at, at all. Cup, so that I don't even have to see it. This is you don't even want to me. see it. Yeah, what, I don't you, when see you when it. you walk after and it crawls down your leg, how much do you hate that? Because <laughs> I'll be like running to the bathroom, really? like please mine, don't. It gets on the floor. Have to do a tight mine cable. mine usually stays in until I like push it out. Well, I'm loose apparently. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have another question. This is a good one. What is the craziest fan experience you two have had? 
I mean, one time I went to Miami for this music festival and this girl was really drunk and it was her 21st birthday and she was literally crying when she met me and was like, I just want to eat your ass so bad. <laughs> and it was like really traumatizing and I was just hugging her so that I didn't have to look at her. She was crazy. She wanted to eat your yeah, she's like so happy to meet me because that she was crying. What? I just want everyone who is watching this at home who is actually gonna probably use this recipe, right, to cook, to know that I'm putting two tablespoons of unsalted butter melted into the five sheets of graham crackers. And now I'm putting a tablespoon of granulated sugar in here. It's the best video ever. Juan is like, I'm really good at baking, but except for when you have to bake and except for when you have to do stuff. <laughs> okay, Lana, what is the most common thing fans ask you when they meet you? Oh my god, I don't even know. Can you get can you give me an example? Like what's one that they ask you? Do they say can you follow me? Can you follow me? Um, I mean they'll ask your picture. Oh, they ask your picture. That's yeah. number one. Yeah, that's number one picture. So like my fans are sort of split up. There's like my fans from Instagram, and then there's like my fans that actually watch my Yeah. And so like the ones from Instagram will be like, Can I get a picture with you? And then the other ones are like, What's your favorite scene? And I'm like, I don't like any of them. <laughs> you, have you seen any of them? Um, I watch them sometimes. You know what I watch of yours all the time? What? That video of you putting a strawberry on a cupcake. Oh she has this really funny video. It's like 17 seconds on Pornhub and she this... literally pops the strawberry out of her butt cheek and perfectly lands it onto a cupcake as a topping. That, that video You should do it for the cheesecakes. On Twitter. Oh, I should. For like our OnlyFans. Yes. I think like... Perez Hilton like commented on that video. Really? Yeah. Like, it was so there. well done. Like I don't know if I could control my sphincter like that well to the point where. Can you wink? <laughs> no. no. One time Riley was trying to teach me the bathroom. She's like, look, you just wink your butthole like this, make it pulsate in and out. And I was like, I don't have that much control over my butthole. Yeah, I kind of like how we're gonna be spreading these on the cheesecake. Do these go up the sides as well to create like a crust or just on the bottom? No, just on the bottom. I mean, I wouldn't say that you have to do it exactly. You could just divide this up by nine. Yeah, I mean, we know what we're doing. We're making a crust. But you have to make it so that it can like- Cover the whole thing. Cover the whole thing and we're gonna like have to mash it down. Okay. What's your favorite dessert? My favorite dessert? Yeah. Hmm, that's a good question. Everything. Oof. Anything with Anything with chocolate. Really? Yeah. Or <gasps> right, my favorite candy is Reese's. But it's not just any Reese's. It's, you know, like the seasonal Reese's where they come in like the little Christmas tree. The tree or the pumpkin? Um, the pumpkin. Oh, yeah. The I pumpkin like, I like better, the tree, I think. The pumpkin, the egg, the Easter egg. I think the Easter egg is too tree. much peanut butter for me. Really? I like the, I like the jack o' lantern better. I put the cereal in first and I put the milk in. Thank, but thank I, God. I can't do. <laughs> I know, it'd be pretty like. I mean, who? I just don't understand. Is this a real argument? Evan, what do you do? Do cereal first. Always. Right? Because you don't want the splash back. I okay. think you're a cereal killer if you do the milk first. That's my opinion. Do we want extra crust? Because we have extra crust that we can use that was pre prepared for us. What do you think? Are you a crusty girl? <laughs> I mean. I didn't mean it like that. I have, I have heard. So, a lot of boys have complained saying that I need to start wearing deodorant. Yeah, do you not wear deodorant? <laughs> Well, I'm trying this new thing, tea tree oil. Oh, it kind of smell, kind of smell. I mean, you kind of smell a little like BO, but you also smell a little bit like tea tree oil. I feel like it's a nice mixture though, like a I little like, bit of I BO. Like little BO. I, like, yeah. I like tea tree oil, I, I put it in my douche. Oh yeah, no, I started doing that too. It's great. Because the boys are complaining. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Lana, well, you're like letting out a little more than you need to. Um, I just know that one time I hooked up, I think it was with Layla, out of her, and then I tasted his and it was like very earthy. And I was like, I want to be earthy tasting. You tasted the body fluid? <laughs> I'm so sorry, Lana. Lana, well, you're like the, the, the most confused <laughs> star ever. Wait, are you doing more? Do you guys still want to eat after all the things we've been talking about? A little bit. What is the next step? Who is your favorite? Oh, part? wait, we have to bake this for five minutes. Five minutes of baking. That goes in the oven for five minutes. In case you actually really want to make what we're making right now. I'll put the recipe link in the Damn. description. Perfect. So we just put the crust in the oven for five minutes. It's going to pre-bake a little bit so that when we put the cream cheese topping on top, it'll be firm and it will not absorb all the cream cheese, right? I'm making things up as I go. I um, How are we going to turn this cream cheese into Do you want to find out? Cake? I'll tell you right now. Make the filling, highlighted right here. Use a handheld or a stand mixer fitted with a paddled, fitted with a paddled whisk attachment. We have that right here. Lemon. Ooh, what? <laughs> what? What? This? <laughs> what? <laughs> she, she's like, I'm just gonna be a cute prop while you do all the baby stuff, okay? I feel like I've been divulging a lot of information. You need to tell us a secret now. What's a dark secret from Linda's childhood? I took a 
fit in my sister's dresser <laughs> when I was sleepwalking one time. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, I'm putting cream cheese and sugar and sour cream. I gave you a spoon. One egg. No shell. Oh, thank you. Lana, you're so helpful. <laughs> the best supervisor ever. Yeah. Some vanilla. Voila. Now, do you like the fun part of beating the mixture together? We're putting all these things together and we have to beat them on medium high. Oh man, it's gonna spray everywhere. Look, it's gonna go all over the place. Uh -oh. oh, no. Not if you're a professional like me. So the last thing to do, well, for now, is put a tablespoon of this onto each one of these mini cheesecake crusts. I'm gonna do it, because Lana doesn't like doing anything. This is a <laughs> And also, I trust myself better. This means we both can do it. Oh, did you wanna work? <laughs> I'm just here to roast you. Johnny Bananas wants to know, how many times have you had sex in your entire life? Parentheses estimate. <laughs> Lana has probably had sex less than me, even though she's shot like real porn for a long time. Because I just don't feel like you have that much sex. I hate sex. <laughs> wow, you heard it here first. Have you ever said that before? Have I ever said it? Yeah. Um, I hate sex unless it's with someone that I'm in love with, then I like it. What do you hate about it? Just that it's a spit that you don't trust? Uh, it's the body fluids thing. Plus, like, if I'm not in love with you, I'm just like, it just feels like I'm like going through the motions. And there's literally so many other things I could be doing than having sex that I don't even want to have. So I just don't do it. I have a really bad scar on my arm from one time I was baking brownies. Well, actually, it's kind of gone now. I was like 12. Actually, it's not even there it's anymore. Gone. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna set the timer for 20 minutes. That's how long it says it takes to cook. I am probably gonna burn my mouth by eating them right when they come out. I don't know about you guys, I'm, I'm really into doing that. I do it kind of a lot. Uh, we're gonna take a break and take some photos maybe. Let's and then it. when we come back, we will decorate these cupcakes. Come back for the commercial break. <laughs> I just, I just make it <sighs> oh, it smells so good. So these were only supposed to be in there for 20 minutes, but I added five because I wasn't certain that they were cooked and I don't want to eat any raw eggs. Right, Lana? Right. Right, okay. I was telling her, can't be doing it, Lana. I was eating raw eggs and she was like, don't be salmonella. So I'm gonna take these out of here and put them on the cooling rack so that they can cool faster, so that we can decorate them faster, so that we can eat them faster because we're just really yeah, hungry at this point. I feel like I should ask you more questions. Where's my phone? You're like, why is this the interrogation of Lana Rhodes? It really is though. I like these lights that you have up here. Thanks. I installed them myself. Oh, really? You no, put no, these in? Oh, don't. okay. <laughs> I got the house like this. I don't know how to do anything. I haven't even decorated this. You can clearly tell. When is Lana doing vlogs? I mean, I was just talking about She's this, just guys. Telling me. I am going to start doing daily vlogs that I post on my Pornhub channel and also on my YouTube channel and on my OnlyFans. And it's going to have different editing cuts for each platform. So keep an eye out. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Why daily? Um, cause I need basically, like for OnlyFans, they want like daily content. Got so it. it just sort of goes hand in hand. So I'm just saying this cause I, 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 for a period of my life, vlog daily. It's a lot of fucking work. It's a lot of work, it's a lot of fun though. You feel like you're like really having a community with I your wanna, audience. I wanna like get used to it. Cause like. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. I think you should commit to like three a week. Yeah. And then you should. Build my way Because up. what's gonna happen is from my experience, you like, I'm doing daily and, and then, then the video's late 10 hours and then yeah. the video's late two days. And then, and then all of a sudden you feel like like you didn't do a so good job. Well, yeah. you just feel like you did a bad job instead of saying, I'm gonna do three this week, and then you yeah. reach that goal, and then you're like, okay, let me try four. Okay. okay. I have to because say also said, just kidding, guys, I'm not <laughs> gonna do daily vlogs, so it's too much work. <laughs> but also, like, are you gonna get an editor? Because, like, that's like, you yeah. film, and then you have to edit that night, and then you have to upload in the morning, yeah. so, like, it is, it gets heavy, but you I'm, need, like, I'm, help. I'm not doing daily vlogs. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try my best. I think being consistent is really important. It's really hard. But you don't have to be daily. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Good advice, Lana, from like an experienced pro, because I'm new Look at my it. channel, I, I upload sporadically and it's not good. Oh, what other, can I ask you some questions? Sure, I'm sure they're like only for you because I talked about um, you I mean, week. you could answer this one. Who have you had the most fun hooking up with? Ooh, for work. Um, for work, I always say Carmen Carmo, just because like she is a lot of fun and you can like really tell that she likes girls when she's hooking up with you. And that's always good, because you like, I don't know, if you like girls, you gotta get messy. You just gotta get with it, you know? Yeah. I've so. never shot content with her, but I've had some conversations with her and she seems like a pretty solid girl. No, she's really awesome. Okay, these are gonna cool. And then I thought I bought maraschino cherries, uh, but they did not 
come in the delivery with the groceries. So I'm glad that I ordered lemon curd at the last minute. We're gonna put lemon curd. Wait, 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 hold up. Where's the cherries? They're not here? Oh no. <laughs> You promised me cherries. I ordered them, but they didn't arrive, and I just realized it. But we have raspberries. Have raspberries. Have raspberries. Do you like raspberries? I love raspberries. Thank God you didn't get blackberries, though, because I have an intolerance. Yeah, that test that you did, I did it, and it came back that my two favorite foods I was like slightly allergic to. Which is blackberries? Blackberries and scallops. I have like an intolerance or something, or a mean so you reaction. Like feel sick when you have them, or do you get like itchy or what? No, I don't feel anything. Just like the test said that I shouldn't eat them. So you should just like try one day. You should just like eat a bunch of them and see what happens. <laughs> I mean, what if I just break out even more than I am, and I just like you look fine, but okay. Uh, how long do you think is like the appropriate adult amount of time to wait before we just demolish these? Because I feel like I don't want to be nice. Probably like we have to wait till it's like not gushy inside, otherwise it's gonna be gushy. Gushy. You don't like it gushy? gushy. I like it gushy. <laughs> I feel like we have to wait till it, we're supposed to put them in the fridge, I think. Ugh, you're right. Why are you right? Are you gonna um, fight Because I'm down. Shh, you have to beef out her name. Oh, I will. We don't want to give her a free clout. No, that My boyfriend let this girlfriend, Dr. Phil, suck his and then claim that we didn't discuss exclusivity yet but literally that morning i texted him do not breathe the same air as any girl do not talk to any girls do not get near any girls and so you had the receipts he yeah and he thought that meant i'll let someone suck my so basically he's an idiot and he's you and you idiot. and you let him uh, and now he's spending the rest of his life sucking up to me and making yeah. it up to me um but this question was what was your first thoughts about mike when you saw him for the first time on that video what'd you think literally logan asked me would you ever be attracted to mike and like i said no and like i literally thought there was no way i will ever like this guy but then i got to know him and now i've fallen and i cannot get back up <laughs> help, help, help. do you really think he's a three as you um, said on twitter now like i think he's like <laughs> evan's like what's happening i think he's a, i think he's a 20 now. <laughs> oh, Shit, you Mike, broke the if you're, scale. If you're watching this, she really likes you. But don't f up again, then you'll be a negative four. <laughs> I put those in the fridge. I'm gonna put them in there for five minutes. My whole fridge smells like garlic, and I don't want them to smell like garlic. Ew. I bought these gar like these like pre-peeled garlics and they, the whole fridge smells like garlic now. What's like a sex tip that you and Adam like have like learned from your relationship together that you could give to other people? Or just a relationship advice? Because you guys have a pretty like good relationship. Yeah, like sex tip it's going well. Or just a relationship. I feel like I shouldn't be giving sex advice. But um <laughs> I just feel like I have like that boring routine relationship oh, wait, sex right I now. Know, I what? know. Why are you so cool and you let like you guys have three ways with other people? Like I was so crazy. Um, I mean, I feel like the way the question gets asked is kind of weird because it's like, oh, you're letting Adam have a three way. It's like I get to have a three way too, and like it's that makes me like happy. I like it, and it's like. Everything's situational. Like I wouldn't have a th uh, have a threesome with just any girl. And it's also like Adam is very his attitude towards threesomes is that we both don't think it's that big does, of a deal. Does he do it like the right way? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Like we're like communicating with our eyes the whole time. Like he'll look at me and he'll be like, "Oh, she needs more right now." I'm coming over, and then you know he'll come over to me, and then he'll be like, "All right, okay, Lena's Lena's out." Because I'll always be like, "Baby, I'm being greedy. Like give some to her." You know, like yeah. it's a very fun, like exciting thing. It's not like we're another girl just so I could be like, oh my god, you f her longer than, you know what I mean? But he'll always look at me like, for the f he's like, do you I'm want like, it? Who's gonna get it? Like, yeah, like, who, who's gonna make me buzz? Me and Mike, like, talked about this, and like, because- Oh, I don't think you could do it. Because of my body fluid issues, I was like, one, she's gonna try to kiss me, and I don't want that. Two, I couldn't, like, hop on after her, because then her <laughs> juice is gonna get on my <laughs> Like, I feel like I would just want to watch, and just, like, see But do you want to watch? But then also, I might- freak out yeah so, <laughs> i'm like i don't think you want to watch yeah yeah i don't know i feel like i might like do it because i'm like oh it's gonna make him so happy and then like i'll see it he has and to then, earn it he just up stop. yeah 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 he doesn't deserve it you don't but like it. don't do you feel like there's any girl that you would be like okay with he's like showed me some girls and like they're like ratchet like if we're gonna do it i want it to be a girl that like she's like a supermodel and so amazing <laughs> emirata like, call us <laughs> lena okay. why did you get into adult work you make a lot of money they look so and good. you get to work for yourself and do whatever you want. And that is the part that is more appealing you to me. You get to be a boss ass bitch. Yeah, you get to call the shots. But when I got into adult work, I didn't really know I was getting into adult work. I feel like it was like an accident. <laughs> you sort of, kind of like in where they 
it just like somehow slides in. Yeah. And it just slides in. All of a sudden in. you find yourself stuffed up and you're like, how did I get here? It smells really lemony, even though there's only a little bit of lemon in it, but maybe that's just because I opened the lemon curd thing. There's actually like a food question. Ooh, what is it? Are you concerned about your daily calorie intake when choosing something to eat? I have graduated from that stage in my life. I try to generally eat healthy, but I'm not like tracking my calories or anything like that because I feel like that will just turn you into Make a you psycho. Unhealthy. It's just too much. For me, I can't. Yeah. For me, what I eat is mostly based on like what makes me feel bloated just because pretty much every day I have to shoot something on camera, whether it's a picture or a video. Um, and so it's just like keeping like so myself just mostly unbloated. Eat. Yeah, like well, these are bloating food. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're already done. After food. this, I'm donezo for the day. <laughs> I have dinner after this, but I'm actually like really hungry right now, so I'm really excited to eat these. I don't really know like the proper way to lemon curd these, but I'm just gonna imagine that that's fine. If I knew I was gonna do this before, I would have maybe created like a little bit of a hole and like so so they could pour it in after. I don't know. They, they might not look pretty, but it smells good. But they taste good. I mean, right? we could like smooth it on there. Everything that I bake is never as aesthetically pleasing as it is in the photos online, but I'm not a professional baker and I brought a baker who doesn't bake to come help me even though she claimed that she's gonna help me. Also, I forgot we have whipped cream that we could have used as a topping and now they're all lemon curded, so we can scrape it off if we have to. But do you think that you can handle the menial task of putting raspberries on top of this lemon curd? No, I think we're gonna have to have your sister Wait, I just like combined sister. sister. Yeah, my sister. sister. That's a great that's word for her. Wait, that that's word. A my, my assistant. Sister. I was trying to say oh, your shit. assistant slash sister, um, but your sister. Trademark that, a sister. A sister. She is my a sister. Call the sister in. <laughs> I can't decide if one or two is cuter. Maybe three. Wait, what if we put <clears throat> on top of the lemon curd? I'm trying something. Oh. I didn't think so. <gasps> oh my God, I feel like I just like made this whole thing. Like I made it so much more aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> Please continue, darling. <laughs> down. Oh no. Angle it down. Oh. <laughs> There's only one way Don't to know. eat whipped cream. Oh no. Okay, so we're actually gonna try these. Maybe we can get a thumbnail while we do it. Or a thumbnail first, and then we'll do it. Oh my god. Yeah, all right, let me get to Make a pretty one. This is a very thick crust. Are you excited to bite through it? Oh, we did a really good job. I'm I did a good job. <laughs> <laughs> it was mostly me, Lana. Come on. <laughs> Give credit where it's due. Is it good? Oh, oh yeah. Mm. I think we did a pretty good job. Granted, this is like a, a really easy dessert to make. <laughs> I think we succeeded. Lana, do you think we should share or we should just eat the whole plant? I guess Oven and Pauline will have some too. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually super I'm good. Down. Mm. Lesson for today, Lana's not actually a baker. She kind of lied to me. If you want to see more of her, because she's a lovely lady, she has a YouTube channel, she has a P-Hub channel, which I won't link in the description, oh, but I will I will link everything else in the description oh, so that you can say, find her. Say P-H channel next time, not a P-Hub. There's P word channel. Think that I'm making videos of me peeing all over. She doesn't do that. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching my channel. If you like what I do here, please like my video and subscribe if you feel like it. And have a good day on purpose. I will see you next time.